There are so many individuals who have mentored, influenced, and supported me through the years. Special thanks to PCOM. They allowed me to talk my way into school by way of the Gelb gift of gab. <laughs> what an opportunity. My professional goal from a young age has always been to be a country doctor, except that little hiatus about an astronaut thing I had going on for a while. To serve the rural community that may otherwise not have access to health care, we all have a hand in creating change. I am honored to be a DO. We honored our profession by listening to understand, showing compassion, and treating our patients. We listen to what they have to say. To us, body, mind, and spirit are one. You cannot treat a patient without looking at their entire being and understanding their needs. Little did I know that after 34 years of private practice, PCOM would allow me the opportunity to become the center director at that same facility and teaching became a passion. I have completed my full circle of my medical career. Again, I would love to thank my wife, Barbara, who has done a fabulous job tolerating me. It was the advice from an old school DO who encouraged me to get in involved in osteopathic advocacy. I started locally at the hospital, fighting for parity in scope of practice issues, as well as credentialing. Small gains and wins led to larger issues and challenges. Local, graduated to regional and state issues. Before I knew it, progression to larger roles gave me a voice on the national platform. Representing rural Pennsylvania on the national stage became second nature, and here we are today. I am an AOA, board certified, family medicine specialist and geriatrician, and I am damn proud of it. <laughs>